Times Network also spoke to a victim who filed the complaint uh, with the Mumbai police. Listen in. Bulibai, a matter right now which is in the highlights. Since uh, the dignity of women has been come to a question and there are many, many such victims across the country. But right now, Times Now is speaking to one of the victims here in Mumbai. You have also filed the complaint before the cyber sale. You have also recorded your statement, if I'm not wrong. So what all details have you given to the uh, police or the cyber sale officials? I have shared all the screenshots uh, that were shared with me. Uh, which basis which they have begun the investigation. Okay. How were you approached? How did you come to know that all of this thing is happening? Your name has been. A brand. friend of mine shared it with me uh, on WhatsApp on the first of January. She was targeted the first time around also, which is why they have been very vigilant. Okay. Uh, when the Suli deals happened, and she sent me the WhatsApp saying they started again, and I figured I am also in that list this time. How was around. I was terrified. Okay. I was extremely terrified. I did not open the screenshots. Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, but as we also understand, since you said your pictures were taken, your details were put in on social media, yes. was there any kind of uh, messages or uh, reactions which were getting after that particular incident? I did not see uh, that particular Twitter profile. Okay. I don't know what happened on that Twitter profile. I only saw the screenshots that somebody saved for documentation. I do not know what went on. I did not witness the auction. I did not see Jithap because I was terrified. I did not want to see anything. Rightly, I also want to know that now when there are two people, those are detained uh, by the cops here. One is a 21-year-old uh, boy and another one is a lady to be said. So how do you look at this? Just a young kid and a lady in the entire process. I am shocked, I am disgusted and now that you tell me it's a lady, I am absolutely appalled because this is about um, Islamophobia. The fact that mis Muslim women have specifically been targeted a second time around. Uh, I pity these minds that are filled with so much bigotry that uh, they're doing this the second time around. I mean, what, ki what kind, what kind, what would be, I mean, what is the hate that is you know, and because this is not an isolated event, this is not something that is just happening today. It is a part of the larger hate ecosystem.